Wichita celebrates St. Patrick's Day tomorrow by painting the town green. Cakes Abby Ray is live in Delano where the celebration will take place. Sounds like a lot of fun, Abby. Absolutely, Katie. You know, last year, organizers say 20,000 people visited the Paddy's Day Parade, and the weather was not even perfect then, so they're anticipating plenty of more people coming out this time. Walking down Douglas, you can tell St. Patrick's Day magic is in the air. It's really accepting this part of town, like Delano District. People who love art or music, like it's an excellent place to be able to find other people that have the same interests. Almost every business is decked out in Delano, excited for Saturday's Patty Parade. This parade is such a Wichita tradition. Jennifer Ray owns the Monarch, one of the businesses on Douglas that's bracing for additional foot traffic. I love watching the wagon masters and the wind wagon go by. Um, love watching all the kids out there smiling and laughing and everyone in their green shirts and it's just such a wonderful community event and we're so lucky to be able to be part of it. 80 organizations will be walking in the parade beginning at noon and some of the floats are pretty impressive. This was pretty funny because we have he moves he flosses his teeth so he, he's constantly moving back and forth on the float so that I remember hearing a lot of comments last year about oh look He's a flossing leprechaun. Some Delano businesses are even running specials for the St. Patrick's celebration. The Patty Parade has been taking place in Delano since 2006, but parades like these don't happen overnight. This year it took months of planning. Some advice if you plan to attend? Come early. All the zones that we have open at 10 a.m. The parade starts at noon. People will start getting out here and lying in the streets, setting out their chairs. Definitely come early. Parking's going to be tricky. On top of all of that, Riverfront Stadium will host a giant Wichita flea market on Saturday from 9 to 5, featuring more than 240 different vendors. And those roads should be back up and running around 3.30 tomorrow. For now, I'm live in Delano. Abby Ray, Cake News on your side.